So I'd like to introduce this electrical circuit that I've built right here. And it has a pair of 12 volt solar charging units to charge these two 6 volt motorcycle batteries that I have. And the idea of this circuit is to run like the alternator system of your car. So that I have a fuel source over here which is this sacrificial battery. It goes dead. But when this system is running, these batteries stay capped off with energy. And this battery here goes dead just like if the fuel tank on your car would. But at the end of this fuel tank, these batteries are still full of power. So that's a, to me it's a really important experiment to be able to do this on a circuit board and not have a conventional gasoline burning engine with an alternator system. So it's a new approach that no one else is really taking. I think there's a real advantage to it. Right here is a motor with three generators. And here's a motor with a generator. And these are uh, just regular generators, the, the wind, wind generators right here. So when the motors turn these generators at a sufficient speed, they produce electricity. And that's the key to the whole entire system is that uh, the alternator of a car, it's a generator also. So what it does is when the motor spins, the alternator produces electricity, charges the batteries, and it also provides power to whatever kind of motor that you're running. Like, like I've got this 40,000 RPM 12 volt motor right here that I'm planning on running off of this system. And, you know, I'm trying to extend the amount of energy that goes into the system by uh, introducing uh, uh, static electricity into it also which is something I'm studying. It's just a little test study off, off to the side here that I'm doing. So there'll be, you know, right there's another static generator right there. See, a little glass tube with an Atherton uh, locomotive motor to drive it with. I intend to generate static electricity and dump it into this electrical system and see if I can uh, extend the life of these batteries right here. I mean, it'll give me better gas mileage on my circuit board engine. This battery right here can also be used right here. It's a sacrificial battery. It can only discharge when it's in use, and it can only be charged when it's not in use. So, um, if I had two of these batteries, I would have another one of these right over here in place of this. So, when, when this battery goes dead, I would replace it with this battery that's constantly being charged by the system as it operates. So yeah, there's an eventual uh, kill point to that. And uh, right now, the way I've figured out a way to help alleviate that is to add the solar system, the, the solar charging system. That solar charging system will add the additional energy that uh, would normally be lost from swapping, you know, charging one battery to another. You know, that, that battery swap, you always lose energy. Well, this, this will replace it. And also, you know, the static, the static electricity, I seek to replace it with that also. And if I can achieve the right balance, I can make this machine run continuously without ever shutting off. And we just, you know, doing simple automatic, uh, electronically decided battery swaps. This whole machine will just run continuously until a component breaks. And yeah, that's, uh, um, that's extraordinary. 